Well, hello there, my name is HW, and thank you so much for watching Tone Junkie TV. Uh, it looks like a lot of people are having trouble getting these new reverbs onto their Kemper. Uh, everyone's running around with these little sticks and uh, trying to figure it out. That is what Kemper said you needed to do, and I've had some people call me, say they were having trouble, and I had a buddy of mine, Michael, call me and say he was able to do it with his. Well, uh, I actually just was able to do it without using one of these, so I'm gonna show you really quick how to just do it through Rig Manager, which would be the easiest way possible. I'm not sure why why Kemper's telling us to do it this other way. I literally have the reverbs on my Kemper with the presets, and I'm gonna show you how to do that. Thank you to my buddy Michael for showing me how to get the presets, because that's a little bit counterintuitive. Take So first step, take your USB stick and throw it away. Like literally just throw, just throw it in the trash I, I not even I I personally am not even going to entertain using a USB stick uh, anymore with my Kemper. Um, uh, okay, here's my rig manager. Now mine's going to look slightly different because I've already done it. But um, come right here and uh, under oops, QuickTime player is open. Yep, that's my screen recording. Um, I am going to go under preferences. Come right here under preferences. See where it says automatically check for software updates? You want that. See where it says include beta test releases? You want that. Check both those boxes and hit apply. Now I've already done that. Now, once you've done that, go ahead and come up under here and say manually tell it. Check for software updates. Click it. Mine's gonna say it's up to date. Yours is gonna say you need to download uh, the new Rig Manager 2.1.7. I looked for probably an hour for Rig Manager 2.1.7, where I could download it on the website because they said you needed it to communicate with your Kemper after you updated it. And it's only for that reason that I was looking for that first that I discovered you're able to do this through Rig Manager. I couldn't find it anywhere. I was able to get it through here. Now, once you've done that, what have we accomplished? We have the new Rig Manager. We do not have any reverbs on our Kemper. No problem. Make sure your Kemper's plugged in. Plug it in. It should be communicating with your, uh, with your, Kemp, with your Rig Manager. Go back under here again and say, check for software updates. Mine's gonna say you're up to date. Yours is gonna say that you get to download the new 5.7, I think it is. Yeah, 5.7, that's the new beta reverbs. You're gonna hit that, it's gonna work. Boom, you're gonna be great. It's gonna go through a long process and you're gonna, you're gonna get the new stuff. Here's the problem though. You're not gonna be able to find the new reverbs on your Kemper uh, in the preset menu. I, I couldn't find the reverbs at all. I was able to take my reverb switch, uh, my reverb uh, block, and change it from a reverb to another effect, which means it was unlocked, yay! But I wasn't able to find it, so here's what I had to do. Check it out, I'm gonna flip this around, okay? Here's my Kemper right here, okay? What I had to do was exit out of here. You can see I have it because look, I've got a reverb right here, natural reverb and I've got the reverb right here, and don't worry, I'm not tricking you, I did not plug in my flash drive, there's just no reason to. You're gonna, you will have updated the Kemper once you've gone through that, once you've checked for the first update, which is getting the right rig manager, once you have that, you're gonna check again, you're gonna get, you're gonna get the, your Kemper updated, then you're still not gonna see the reverb presets. If you wanna see the reverb presets, hold down the system button, and you're gonna scroll over to, where is it? Uh, factory presets. Can you see that? Factory presets. I'm gonna hit that button. It's gonna say, do you want to import all factory rigs? Hit OK. Now, not only is that gonna give you the factory rigs, um, it's, it's, make sure you back up your Kemper, by the way. There's no excuse to not back up your Kemper before you do this. Um, are there bugs? Uh, yeah, you're not able to um, turn off uh, the reverb once it's, once it's on. However, you can, I'll show you the workaround for that. Some of you know that you can't, now check this out. Here's my reverb, right? It won't work, I can't turn it on. What I can do is hold it down and hit on off, and then it's on. Now I can go back and look, it's still on. These still toggle normally. I can do that, that's fine. These still toggle normally. This one is stuck. So what I've gotta do is hold it down, hit on and off, and boom, it's working. Now, I haven't tried this with performance mode, I haven't tried this with um, anything else. So, is it buggy? I don't know yet. That's a bug, they're gonna fix that bug, and then it won't be a bug. Let me know if you have any questions, put it in the comments, I'll do my best to answer them. In a nutshell, 
all you need to do is turn on beta releases in Rig Manager, check for new updates, you'll get the new Rig Manager. Check for new updates with your Kemper plugged in, you'll get the new stuff. You won't have the reverb presets. Go ahead and say restore factory settings or restore factory presets. You will get the new, you will get the presets of the reverbs because it's a factory preset. Boom. It's on your Kemper, you're set up, you're going. Rig manager's working. I'm HW. See you later, dudes.